Hi everyone. I put together a quick video uh, because I've uploaded the code and the schematic for the uh, arpeggiator that I threw together. I had it on this little board in the first demo, but um, I've loaded it onto the uh, toy keyboard synth because uh, I just wanted to show the way I've mapped out these eight notes for the eight arpeggios corresponds to the eight white keys on the original code so you can if if you've gone to the trouble of making one of these uh, you can load the code on this and it will work on this um, so it's the first eight keys and then um, the highest black key is the speed uh, it's mapped out to that one which is uh, the E flat I believe uh, right now it's uh, this, is the, this is the original code Just with a quick little click of the mouse, let's bring up the uh, arpeggiator. Uploading and waiting. Done. Okay, so. mapped out to these eight. C, E, F, G, A, C, and the rest of the keys have no function except for this one black key. I'll demonstrate. Here's that stutter, that whatever. So if anyone has actually put together something similar to this keyboard and they want to use the uh, arpeggiator code, I've I put it on here first because this is just a cool little uh, small compact standalone unit for, for testing things. And I, I got these two little digital push buttons that I can program for whatever I may need. Um, actually, I only have one of them used in the uh, arpeggiator code for speed. You know, originally I tried to speed up and speed down, but I just decided the one button have it cycle back around to the, to the slowest speed. That, that was fine. I actually kind of like it better because I can jump from the highest to the lowest. Um, and once again, uh, so right now, and obviously I have it plugged into the filter now because your arpeggiator does have the filter output. And uh, simple as a mouse click, compiling, uploading, and <clears throat> Back to the original. So, the code and the uh, schematic for this, for the eight keys and the uh, speed switch, uh, is linked in the description section. And the schematic is actually just the same schematic that I posted when I showed how this worked. And I purposely mapped out the keys such that if you put on, as you've, I've demonstrated, if you put on the arpeggiator code or the original PWM synth code, um, it works fine because I've mapped out the keys to the same, same thing. So uh, comment below, uh, question below, and uh, have a great evening.